And for is a Samsung Galaxy S20 and today I'll show you how to enable and also set up the do not disturb mode. So to get started pull down the notification panel and extend it and you should find do not disturb mode. Now I already removed majority of the toggles right here so that's why it's so empty but the one is right here so do not disturb mode and to enable you just simply tap on it like so and then it's enabled. Now keep in mind if you don't see it uh, right here you also have another page so you can scroll through it and you can find it probably on the second page. And once you enable it that's basically it. To disable it you just tap it back, back on it so it's grey and then it's disabled. And if you want to set it up you actually want to hold the toggle and it will take you to the settings. So from here you have option to turn on a schedule so let's tap on that. And you can either turn the one that is in it, set by default, so sleeping one, and it's basically all week long, starts at 10, ends at 7 a.m. Or you can add your own by tapping the add button, then name it whatever you want, and select the days of the week that you want, want it to be affected in. So I'm going to make a work one, so Monday through Friday, which I'm actually deselecting, so let's do it like this. Saturday and Sunday disabled, uh, start time. I wanted to start at 9 because that's I'm going to start work and at 5 done and save and now it will automatically turn on Monday through Friday from 9 till 5 and also you have option to allow exceptions right here which allows you to for instance when you tap on contacts you can allow contacts from, for instance, contacts only, uh, favorite contacts, or all, or none, which is set by default. Um, so just make favorite contacts as ones that can call me, uh, even though the not disturb mode would be enabled. Messages has the same option, so you can choose, again, the same option if you wish to. You also have the repeat color option, which, for instance, if you have favorite contact only uh, enabled, that they can only call you, and someone from your contact list tries to call you. If you enable this and they call twice within 15 minute period, the second time they will actually be able to reach you. And then on the bottom you have a couple additional options. So you have for instance alarm, media sounds, touch sounds, calendar events and reminders. So if you enable, enable them, they will always uh, give you sound notifications uh, whenever, even though for instance your do not disturb mode is enabled at the moment. So choose whichever one you want, how to set it up, and that's about it. So whatever you have selected here, that's basically what, how it's going to be affected. And by the schedule, it will turn on automatically, so you don't have to do anything with it anymore. And that is basically how you would set it up or enable it manually. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.